Bell has developed a concept helicopter mock-up to showcase some of the ideas that they're working on for future aircraft. The company's future products may not look quite like this, but the technologies may appear sooner than you might think. This project is FCX-1. It is a it's part of our future vision for the rotorcraft industry. It's not a product reveal, but we use it to inspire ourselves, inspire our customers, inspire our suppliers, and also demonstrate some of the technologies that we're looking at for the future. Let's start from the back, for example, the anti-torque system. We have a new anti-torque system embedded in the tail. It's a really great change for Bell. We're typically an open rotor, a VTOL company, but this is a system that we're really interested in, and it's one that we're gonna test fairly soon. Uh, another one of the technologies that we really are proud of is are the morphing rotor blade tips. You know, we can change the diameter of the rotor for different flight regimes and improve performance and efficiency. And we can also really play with the noise uh, as the vortex phasing interacts between uh, blade tip to blade tip. The other exciting technology that we're highlighting is, of course, one pilot. We uh, think the future involves more computer assisted flight. So you start from our fly-by-wire products and you kind of evolve towards this where there are no controls in the cockpit, but there's an augmented reality system whereby the pilot controls the system and lets the computer do all those dumb, dirty, dangerous, and dull jobs and lets the pilot focus on safety and the mission. The FCX-1 features two thermal engines powering the main rotor, but the anti-torque system uses electric motors to drive vanes within the tail boom. This should allow for quieter operation while eliminating the weight and complexity of a traditional shaft-driven system. The technologies that you see here on FCX-1 will come out of, the, uh, out of their development stage at various times. If, again, starting from the back, the anti-torque system, we plan to test a system like that this summer. We're going to get thrust noise and efficiency numbers off of that and have it ready for any of our new development pr projects in the, in the next you know, five years, hopefully, if it all pans out. Some of the others are, are longer lead items. Autonomy is something that a lot of customers want commercially, maybe in a 10-year in a time period. We think that's a great uh, challenge goal, but um, we've got to go steady on that because there's a lot of certification items to, 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 bear, to bring to bear on that. The technology's there, but the cert will be difficult.